Welcome to our trivia night. We're excited to have you all here and test your knowledge with some fun quizzes. We'll be reviewing the correct answers after the 10 questions, so get ready to see how well you did. Let's get started with the first quiz and don't forget to share your scores in the comments below. Good luck! Question number 1. What actress was born Ilinia Lydia Myronoff? A. Meryl Streep B. Helen Mirren C. Judy Dench D. Kate Blanchett <laughs> Helen Mirren Question number 2. What planet is known for the big red spot? A. Venus B. Jupiter C. Uranus D. Mars <laughs> Jupiter Question number 3 what company produces the number 5 perfume? A. Estee Lauder B. L'Oreal C. Chanel D. Dior <laughs> Chanel Question number 4 when did the Sydney Opera House open? A. 1965 B. 1969 C. 1973 D. 1977 1973 Question number 5. In what U.S. state is the International Tennis Hall of Fame? A. Florida B. Rhode Island C. California D. New York Rhode Island Question number 6. What disaster comes from the Japanese term for harbor wave? A. Tsunami B. Earthquake C. Typhoon D. Tornado Tsunami Question number 7. What is Citizen Kane's last word in the film that kicks off the plot? A. Rosebud. B. Majestic. C. Dreams. D. Eternity. Rosebud. Question number 8. In Sue Grafton's alphabet series, what was the A for? A. Abduction B. Assassination C. Alibi D. Apprehension <laughs> Alibi Question number 9. In mathematics, what is the base of the natural logarithm? A. 2 B. 10 C. E D. P E. Euler's number 
Question number 10, which continent has the highest number of recognized countries as of 2023? A. Africa B. Asia C. Europe D. Oceania Africa. Well done. You've completed the 10 multiple choice questions. Let's review the answers. Question number one, what actress was born Ilinia Lydia Myronoff? The correct answer is B, Helen Mirren. Helen Mirren was born Ileina Lydia Myronoff on July 26, 1945, in Hammersmith, London, England. Question number two, what planet is known for the Big Red Spot? The correct answer is B, Jupiter. Jupiter is known for the Big Red Spot, a giant storm that has been raging on the planet for at least 300 years. Question number three, what company produces the number five perfume? The correct answer is C, Chanel. Chanel is a French fashion house that produces the famous perfume, Chanel number no. five. Question number four, within three years, when did the Sydney Opera House open? The correct answer is C, 1973. The Sydney Opera House opened in 1973, making it one of the most iconic buildings in Australia. Question number five, in what U.S. state is the International Tennis Hall of Fame? The correct answer is B, Rhode Island. The International Tennis Hall of Fame is located in Newport, Rhode Island. Question number six, what disaster comes from the Japanese term for harbor wave? The correct answer is A, tsunami. A tsunami is a series of ocean waves with very long wavelengths, typically several hundred kilometers, caused by large-scale disturbances of the ocean, such as earthquakes, volcanic eruptions, and landslides. Question number seven, what is Citizen's Kane last word in the film that kicks off the plot? The correct answer is A, Rosebud. Rosebud is the last word spoken by Charles Foster Kane in the film Citizen Kane. The word is a reference to a childhood sled, and its significance is a central mystery of the film. Question number 8, in Sue Grafton's Alphabet series, what was the A for? The correct answer is C, A is for Alibi. A is for Alibi is the first novel in Sue Grafton's Alphabet series, which features private investigator Kenzie Milhone. Question number 9, in mathematics, what is the base of the natural logarithm? The correct answer is C, Euler's number or E, Euler's number, represented by the symbol E, is the base of the natural logarithm and is approximately equal to 2.71828. Question number 10, what continent has more separate countries? Africa or Asia? The correct answer is A, Africa. Africa has 54 separate countries, while Asia has 48. Thanks for watching. I hope you had fun answering these trivia questions and learned something new. If you enjoyed this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribing to my channel for more fun quizzes and trivia challenges. And don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss a new video. If you have any suggestions for future videos or topics you'd like to see covered, please let me know in the comments below. I love hearing from my viewers and want to make sure I'm creating content that you enjoy. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.